Party, party, come on. Oh boy. Oh yeah. Oh shit. He's running. He's running. Oh shit. Oh my god, they're floating in. Even more coming. Oh my god. How many are there? Anyone get a head count? <laughs> what do you say guys? Time to hit the, hit the trap base soon? Oh my god, they keep coming. They keep coming more. Jesus. No, this is no good. Oh, yeah, yeah. Trap! I'm trapped! Fuck the blade trap. The blade trap. No! The wrecking ball. No! No! This is gonna be my death. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. I hate this. So fucking. Oh my god. Beating. My, all my traps are still alive. Jesus. And now you die. Oh. What? Oh. Okay. Try it again. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, my. <laughs> what did I do? Can't you just die? Take it through the grinder, okay? Come on. Come on. Oi, oi. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What did I just do? <laughs> The point. Oh, I just realized my health is very low. Challenge me, dude. I will fuck you up. Come on, yeah. Oh, no, no. What did I do? No, 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 no. All right. Welcome back to Mr. Chill Channel. We are on episode 9 of my play series of Game Night of the Dead, as you 
old no. Probably. So, last night we finished up the horde night and we have made some repairs to the damage. We put up some barbed fence and I'm gonna show you what I just made. Have the resources for it. And this is the place where we're gonna put it. That's right, that's right, guys. We have ourselves an animal trap. Yes! That's fantastic. And this big piece of meat will hopefully attract the zombies from quite a distance. So they will ignore me, whatever I am, whatever I do. I can do my own shit, repair, reload, traps. They will just focus on getting to this piece of meat. So they will see this meat and they will go up because they want to get to it. They will come up to the trap base, go to all my traps, and here I have a pendulumium. I don't know if I probably... Uh, no. Fuck that. The thing is, it will hopefully smack them down back to the ground level, so they have to run through the gauntlet traps again. So what's that? Yeah, it's probably just... yeah, so... I think this will be great. So plan ahead is just to reinforce the base even more. Our fence is the key because I want them to uh, die and yeah I want to reinforce that meat a lot. You see this podium I made that so I can easier enter the base if I run between my my workshop and the trap base. I can jump out and in the base the same direction. So, from last night, what I saw them run, hopefully, this will be the path that they will take when they go around it. Because they will see the meat, they will try to go the shortest path to get it. And that should be against the walls here. Or the foundations. I want to put traps here so they constantly hitting them, right? So the plan is continue reinforce and build more barb fence until we hit the night. So the base is as ready as it can be. So let me fast forward some of the build, all right? some zombie encounters at the base. Let's see how they react. Okay, they are still on to me. They're still on me. Okay, they're still on me. Uh, no. Yes, you see? You see? They lost interest. They are looking for the meat. Oh, that's a great... Okay, so for those of you who don't know, I play the survival difficulty. Oh, the zombies are quite tough, yeah.
Oh yeah, all these barb fans is... Yeah, you know. Exactly the life like this. So yeah, you see I have zombies on my tail. And I'm gonna show you exactly how effective the animal trap is. So here we are. They are seeing it. They just ignore me and run for the meat. They just see the meat and they will run through the path. Simple as that. Yeah, so we go back and continue farming for our barbed fence. We also need to upgrade all the wooden foundations and walls to stone. We need stones. And I thought, in the middle of everything, why not just put up some bird nests to get some eggs right it'll be good all right so we need to test how effective the animal trap is they are following me and yeah they lost interest there they lost interest give me my bat my arrows back thank you Yes, and my reliable source, the ring of death of zombies, I need to replace and restore that because this has been my last resort so many, many, many horde nights now. So I just, I just want to know that it still exists, so this is where I can lead the horde if shit happens. More barred fence. So I just remembered from yesterday, it was very dark and I thought we really need to light up the place, get some fire going and I can easier see the zombies pathing also if I need to correct some barbed fence the day after, day after the fortnight. All right.
also finishing up the barbed fence around the entrance to the trap base. Feels important to get that in place before the night. Right, we are finally here. The start of the way of this night. The meat is in place. Barb fence is ready. I feel great. I have big hopes for tonight. I think this will be a good night. Let's see what actually happens. So I think the barbed fence will take care of most of the beginner zombies, so I'm gonna focus on trying to get a roof going here. They are coming. Hear them hitting the traps, that's good. good. Really good. I'm actually going back to my workshop. I'm gonna get me some logs so I can finish up the roof. Wish me the very best. the logs fast. Need the lumber. Get back. Let's get back. place here so I think I have to put one there so I can put one no what put one there okay I need to patch patch up the holes here instead. For now I can fix the other other roof later. Oh, I gotta be careful here. Oh, don't want to fall down. Yeah. All right, one more. we go I should be able to repair I'm not sure reload I'm not sure we'll see we'll see it's a little bit risky being up here though they can maybe leap up here jumpers 
have a good overview here of the pathing. So they run towards the base, missing all that spike. So they run in the middle there of the lawn. Here is the first part fans to hit. Looks like like they see the meat when they come to that edge. That is the case. That is lovely. He died before he even got here. Yeah, look at them. They are running sideways. And they see the meat. They don't even bother hitting on the barb fence. They just... They are so focused in the meat. Jeez. Oh. This, this is great. They are coming here. I can put down some more here. But they seem to path right here. Only damage them a little bit more. Yeah, like that. Oh, we took the inside. Okay. Yeah, but that's that's really good. I could probably just I could I could easily jump down there. They don't even bother me. It's been one hour, not a single trap has been set off, so they all died from the barbed fence so far. But before they even reach the traps. fun this is easy I can't wait to see the the big horde when they come the mass what will happen what will happen I'm a little bit afraid though if, if they come in big masses They will glitch up here. They are so close to the foundations. 
that will be bad because that means they are up on the foundation and they can run my trap my animal trap back there I'm gonna move this actually here put it right here so if they come here to the meat they will eat some spikes on their feet if that's a good one I think if it goes as well as I hope I might have Good time to actually go and scavenge some barrels and stuff towards city so I can make even more traps. I also need to upgrade all my wood to stone. Hopefully that will be no issue till next night. Right, hour two is here. Let's see, let's see. Oh, here they come. Here's the big party. How will this hold? Oh shit, I hear a lot of hits on the bark fence. There's a mutated one. How far will that go? How far did that go? I haven't? Oh, there. Oh, some traps. Okay, okay. Oh no, he died there. Okay, okay. He did not reach me. Yeah, I need to upgrade these stone. We turn on fire. Oh, another one died on the exactly the same spot there. Holy shit, okay. Yeah, I think they followed me there. Oh Jesus, yeah. So when I am back there by the trap, they don't see the me, so they follow me. But they don't go around. They actually try to tear down my base. When I'm over here, they will come towards me, and then they see the me. Forget about me. Okay, so it's a bit dangerous to then actually load traps. Why did it became? Did everyone die? Load, no, repair, repair. Okay, I have some fire to take care of. Did everyone die? Wow. I think everyone... It's still hour two. We're still in hour two. Yeah, the fire mutated monster must have exploded by the entrance or something. Oh my god. This is the first Fortnite that actually ended in the second hour. It started and ended in the second hour. You can actually see here. 
Which one is effective and which is not? These are, these are not even damaged. What? These are bloody as hell, but they are not damaged. Does that mean, as I thought, when they see the... It's not even worth repairing, but I do it anyway. When they see the animal trap, they just keep ignoring these barbed fans. They just walk past it. that can I camp oh yeah all right well that was probably the easiest horde night I've been I am I'm really happy that means that my design of a trap base is working at least at these levels at a very very good, good pace and it's not even finished i have a lot more to put into it upgrades and more traps even more barbed fans because i could see the pathing when they came from the field there they run quite a lot without hitting anything are not even damaged. Wow. Yeah, here are some damage. I mean, it's not even worth putting a tree branch on it. Tree branches are the most required resource in this game at, at this state, in my opinion. They are used in so many recipes. I wish there was a way that you could um, make tree branches out of logs. Like you get, I don't know, five or ten tree branches for each log. Something between those numbers. That would be really, really good. Because I have so much logs that I don't even use just to get the tree branches. You cut down trees and bushes, you get the logs for free. Alright, well, this was a great night. A huge success. And I didn't die. That's a success in itself all right I am going to wrap this up and if you like the content please hit the thumbs up that really helps out my videos to get a little bit notifications I did the meat get damaged by the way anyway thanks for watching and have a great day